American tanks were overwhelmingly superior to Japanese tanks in World War II. As for why, some of that is their fault, some of it is not. And so we'll give you this as an example. The Type 97 was the heaviest tank available that the Japanese had. But its high-velocity gun was only 47 millimeters, and at its thickest, the armor was only around 1 inch. So against an American M4A3 Sherman with a 75 millimeter gun and 2.5 inch thick armor, this thing was about to crumple like a goddamn paper lantern. The reality of the situation was, while Japan was one of the first powers to really be experimenting with armored warfare and tactics, tanks did not have the resources or the support to function as an actual fighting force. The Japanese were strapped for resources on basically all sides, and it was a constant competition between the branches as to who was going to get what resources when. The tanks and armored vehicles that they did have were primarily used as infantry support weapons. And when Japan was invading China, that was fine. As China's military forces were essentially pure infantry, with a lot of that infantry not having modern guns, or sometimes not guns in general.